Today's fountain pen unboxing is of a Kenshu fountain pen. It has the red cardboard outer sleeve with the platinum branding and a subtle design. And you slide that off and inside is a, a, a matte red um, gift box and it's cardboard, but it's also hinged and it has the platinum name in silver. You open that right up and you've got a white interior with a silver um, logo. And, uh, and then you have your Platinum 3776 Kenshu. It does come in a plastic sleeve. And it has the uh, little tag on the clip, like you'll usually see with your Platinums. And here's a quick look at your Kenshu release. Okay, just real quick before we dive into that, you lift up that false bottom and underneath you have your pin information. And this is the bookmark that comes with your um, Kenshu. Um, and this is a really interesting addition because this bookmark commemorates the um, completion of the series. So the Kenshu is the final release in this series, in the Fuji Shankai, Shankai series. And it's in the shape of the 3776 uh, Century Fountain Pen. And if you look closely, it features each of the different designs in the series. So that's that's interesting. You get this cool bookmark included with your purchase. Um, um, just celebrating that the series is now complete. Um, also with your pen, you do get a little packet of goodies. You'll find you get an ink cartridge with your pen and you also get your 3776 Century User's Manual and then you also get your warranty card and then the final piece is your 3776 Century Kenshu um, ID card so it'll have your uh, pin's number and the um, basic information identifying your pin as part of this um, special series. It says the Japanese word Kenshu refers to an autumn scenery covered with colorful leaves like an image of Nishiki textile, the luxurious Japanese brocade. Such spectacular autumn scenery blanketed in fiery fall foliage is expressed on Kenshu. So that's very cool. Okay, the Platinum 3776 Kenshu is a limited edition and it is the final release in the Fuji Shankai series, and it is a brilliant red with gold trim. It does have detailed faceting um, meant to depict the fiery foliage that it's, the pin is named after. So you can kind of get a good look at that here. Along with that gold trim, I do like the pairing of the gold trim with the, with the vivid red. Your pin clip, got your standard pin clip. And you've got your gold ring um, coming off the top of that pin clip. And then above the center ring, you have another thin gold ring. And in your center ring there, you'll notice um, some detailing. You've got your um, platinum, made in Japan. century and then you have another thin gold ring near the bottom of the pin. So this is a cartridge converter pin and it does come with a gold converter. I also like that they included a thin gold ring here above the threading on the barrel for when your pin is uncapped or posted. Let's see. Pin does post. So here's a quick look at the at the nib. This is a gold nib. It's blended prep. It is blend. It is a branded nib. Um, so you've got your three seven seven six, your platinum um, logo indication there, and that's followed by the fourteen carat identifier, along with the um, nib size. That you so that is your platinum three seven seven six Kenshu fountain pen. If you're interested in more information, visit pinchley.com.